my friends, look at this plate of delicious trout. And that is what we're going to cook today. Hello and welcome back to Aspen Cooking. Are you ready to cook this beautiful creamy trout on a spinach bed with me? Yeah, I'm sure you are. Let's get right to it. For this cook, we'll use all of these ingredients. Let's have a look. We'll start with the avocado oil. We'll use some fresh spinach, cherry tomatoes, garlic, black pepper, salt, onion powder, Parmesan cheese, and of course, cream. This is a lake trout, so a still water trout. It has these tiny, tiny scales. I'm not gonna go through trouble of cleaning this because what I'm going to do is I'm going to fry it pretty well on the skin side and these scales will, well, pretty much melt. This is a, a lake trout, so I'm going to fry it a little bit more, and this guy will have um, some bones. You can use any redfish, like salmon, for example. Salmon will be perfect for this dish, and there will be almost no bones in that fish. Depends on, of course, how it's uh, cut and how it's trimmed. But have a look. All of these, all of these sexy, delicious pieces right here for you. Preheat our skillet and add some oil. And we're putting fish skin down first. Okay, literally just about one minute on each side. This fish is very delicate. And we're going to flip it onto another side. So both sides get some heat. Just like that. Beautiful. Super tasty. Time to get our fish off of the skillet. Chopping up some garlic. Add garlic. What I need to achieve is for the garlic gives out its fragrance and infuse the oil. It's time to add cherry tomatoes. Another 20 seconds and the spinach gets it to go. Look what happened to our spinach. It's time to add some cream using about 200, 250 milliliters or so. Just like that. It is time to add our spices using some of the ground black pepper here to taste, of course. Some salt using that to taste as well. And garlic powder. And right before we will add our fish, we're going to infuse our mixture with some Parmesan cheese. And it's time for our fish. We'll add fish back into the mixture so it can absorb all this tasty aroma. And we'll finish cooking. We brought the heat back up and now we're going to cover our dish and let it finish. We'll see you shortly. You guys ready for it? Let's give it a look. Look how colorful. Oh, and the smell. Oh my God, that smell. 
let's plate this. Let's grab our fish. Wow, that is so aromatic, so flavorful, and how simple this dish is. Oh my God, so creamy, the texture. Guys, you must try this dish. If you like what you see, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll be back with more videos for you. This is how you're supposed to plate things. Oh yeah. Show them, baby.